what would you say are some innovative strategies business leaders can use to create those distinct employee experiences, perhaps like the hackathons that you mentioned, that enable frontline workers to concentrate on the most impactful and fulfilling aspects of their jobs? And how does AI play a role in that? Excellent. Excellent. Thank you for the question. I mean, we're focused um, because of our history. Uh, we, we grew up as you know, the, the market leader in, in workforce management. So as a result, we've been very, very deep in a number of industries from healthcare to retail, uh, to hospitality, uh, to manufacturing, where there's an enormous, enormous amount of frontline workers. And, uh, you know, what has happened over, over the years is technology has been designed and built by uh, folks who like to design it for themselves. Mm -hmm. uh, and that... It's, it's not a, a bad thing. It's very normal. You you do things you understand and 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 want to do. And what we're trying to do is really go and spend time with uh, some of the folks who may not be the technology, uh, you know, leader uh, who may have you know very complex task switching kind of uh, situation that may not have a mobile phone. I mean, yes, it's hard to believe. But you know there there are different types of needs that frontline workers uh, may have, um, and uh, at the same time, many of them are also experiencing uh, the consumerization of technology. So they are there are some of them that have you know a really really deep and and profound experience with technology you know, driven by Instagram or TikTok or or whatever other thing. So I, I think it's a really uh, huge, huge, huge opportunity for, for us and also other technology providers to say, let, let's reinvent that experience for the frontline worker. Let's make it easy um, for them to uh, you know, embed that in their workflow. Let's not make it uh, another you know, source of work and complexity. Let's make it easy for them to not have to uh, look and learn how to use an application, but make it so intuitive that they can't, uh, you know, very much, uh, you know, jump into uh, wherever they need to do. Um, so I, I think that's kind of part of the mission that we're on is to create these experiences uh, for frontline workers that are intuitive, personalized, and contextualized. 